Good morning, hot dogs. We are hoping you have a great morning. Today we will be talking about lunch, bowling tryouts, sports, and more after the pledge. Please stand. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Reminder that the bowling callouts are this, thurs this Thursday, September 2nd, at 6.45 p.m. in the Big Shelter House at TPA Park. If you missed the swimming and diving callout meeting, make sure to email Coach Robbins or go talk to him if you have any questions or concerns. Remember, first fall workout for girls basketball will be tomorrow in the auxiliary gym from 3 to 5 p.m. All forms need to be up to date on final forms. If you have any questions, see Coach Britt or contact him. Not in sports and weather. The dogs open the season as Clayton County champs with the 28-14 win over Clinton Prairie. The offense focused on the rushing attack this week, totaling nearing 200 yards on the ground and two rushing touchdowns. The team also sprinkled in some long pass plays, one of which resulted in the dogs' third touchdown of the game. The defense struggled at first, but still managed to create three turnovers. A fumble recovery and an interception were two big plays. The defense capped off the night with a scoop and score touchdown off a second fumble. That brings the takeaway total to nine over the span of two games for def the defensive unit. The special teams had a great game. The kickoff coverage limited Prairie's return yards, and the kick return team did a great job covering up some short kickoffs. The team. The team looks to continue to improve this week and get better at details and physicality of the game. <sighs> Friday, the Hot Dogs take on Tri-West at home. Kickoff is at 7. The JV plays at Tri-West on Saturday at 10 in the morning. <laughs> Lastly, for ladies golf. They, completed, they competed at county tournament on Saturday. Emily Shipley shot a personal best with an 89. Kristen Shipley also shot a personal best with a... 111. Great job, ladies. Now to AV with cross country. Thank you. The boys team plays four out of 15, 15 teams, beating conference teams Western Boone and Danville while falling to Lebanon. The boys were now 4-1 and against second more conference opponents. The boys were led by the top pair of Bautista Ventura and Perez, finishing fourth overall. The girls team plays 7 out of 13 teams, beating Sagamore Conference opponent Danville, while falling to Weibo and Lebanon. The girls are now 2-3 and three against Sagamore Conference opponents. The girls were led by the top pair of Reed Gale and Alanis, finishing 3rd overall. In the JV race, Shipley finished 5th out of all the girls. Good morning. Now for today's weather. This morning it was 64 degrees. Today's high will be 82 degrees and the low will be 59 degrees later tonight. It should not rain later today. There's a football game Friday against Tribal Central. The theme is Mardi Gras. You can buy your gear in the comments starting Wednesday. For lunch today, lines one and two will be chicken nuggets and lines three and four tacos. And for tomorrow, lines one and two will be cheeseburgers and lines three and four chicken strips. Also, coach, coach Kids will be available hourly, monthly throughout the school month. School months, they will be providing resources and help to those in need with school and in the right pathway to success for all grades 9th through 12th. Let's hear a short message from our old friend Ivan Santos. Hi everyone, my name is Ivan Santos and I graduated from Frankfurt High School in May of 2021. I am now attending IUPY. One of the greatest things I learned while in high school is the value of networking, which oftentimes requir requires us to get out of our comfort zone. But the relationships and support you can build are truly invaluable. Coach Kids, in partnership with Purdue Extension, are launching the Friends for Life Mentoring Program for, five, for high school students this fall. I encourage you to get out of your comfort zone and say yes to this great opportunity and sign up to be paired with a mentor. Give yourself the opportunity to have a sounding board to explore your options after you graduate from, Frank, from high school and provide you with guidance, support, and connections in the process. Sign up by seeing your counselor, contacting Coach Kids, or Purdue Extension by September 8th.
Thanks, Ivan. I hope you're having a great time over there. That is it for the announcements today. Thank you guys for watching. If you guys enjoyed, leave a like and subscribe. We hope you guys have a great rest of your day. Bye, guys.